here we go with another vlog and today we will actually are on the job site so we'll go a little more depth in how the pump works and just in general like how's the setup this is the pump this is the setup we have tarts like i have said previously um when it's on top for it not to meant to pour for someone not to get on top of the water tank now we have also tarts in the grounds and in the ground therefore to avoid any um cement extras now we also cover these the steel plates just for um so some men don't get in it and then we also have like the license plate on the other side so we have to protect that at all costs um we usually set up like this um we have extra precaution of any leakage that might happen while we pump and yeah so this is what it looks like now these are the pumps that um the hoses that are for the pump they are two inch and um, they look like this. So let's grab one. So it's two inch, the pump goes through. And then again, that's why we have the little screen over on this side that stops any rocks coming through. This is a tar again to avoid any sort of damage. So this is another um, tar and then this is a screening. So this is how it looks inside and we poured um i think it's hydraulic oil and the hydraulic oil is for the cement not to stick into the pump now we also fill water tanks for 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 more water for to be able to wash faster that's the hydraulic oil on the side and this is a setup now for the hose they are 25 feet long um they ran around the whole we only have one two three we only have three so 75 feet and this is what we'll be working today now as we pump we'll probably i'll try and record some but sometimes it just happens too fast out there's no really time to grab your phone so yeah but this is a little of how we set up kind of catched up a little bit on what's happening right now it is 12 15 and we've been waiting for the cement since 11 we got here around 10 to set up and the cement should have been here 11 to 12 so um something about concrete pumping is you never know what time you will make it out just because you never know like um you never have a real time frame unless you know specifically that you just need one truck and that's it but usually it also depends on like what kind of work you're doing or what kind of job you're doing um so of as of right now we're just doing mostly um like flat work that's what they would call it um we're not doing nothing that's like um with the bricks usually with the bricks it's more time consuming just because we have to help the pumper and hold the hold the hose in a certain way but as of right now we're pretty much waiting for the cement i called and they said that they had they were barely getting any trucks and their closest truck was from mission valley and right now he's in line to get loaded and to come over to where we are which we're not far from them but it's just you never know sometimes when i have class right after i have to leave i always notify them like hey i gotta go i notify my dad because my dad is usually the one with that is pumping if it's not him it's me and i will also include a little video of what how you pump but um yeah so right now it is 12 15, 12 15 now and yeah we're still waiting for the summer but yeah uh that's a little update for today's vlog